Good morning everyone and welcome back to my second YouTube video ever. Today I am in Weatherby in Yorkshire here for the 2019 Road World Championships. Um, I'm here with the team, staying in a cottage with them. Um, I'm only here for two days because I'm off on another adventure. But I am helping out the team because the para girls on our squad, Katie Toft and Hannah Dines and Sarah Story, have a para international race here over the next coming days from the 20th to the 22nd. Good morning, everyone. Good morning. <laughs> what are we doing again? now? Just getting the bikes ready for the race, fitting the numbers, transponders. Transponders on, no higher than 100 centimetres on the left hand front fork. She's Katie's, so she's still got the turbo wheel in and we'll change that for the race wheel after she's warmed up. Looking forward to it? I am, I can't wait. <laughs> it's a nice day for a race as well. I know, look at it, sun's shining in Yorkshire, blue skies. Woo! This is Hannah Dines' trike, lovely piece of kit. Speed look at that handlebar tape, it's looking fresh. The numbers are just going on, front race wheels in, transponders on, nearly ready to go. <laughs> Hannah, are you ready? Are you ready to race today? <laughs> yeah, yeah. I'm really, I'm really buzzing for it. <laughs> it's <laughs> seven minutes past time. twelve. Uh, what's your start time? <laughs> <laughs> Three. <laughs> Five. So what um, is this race today? This is the Yorkshire International uh, Paracycling C1, which means it's like one of the low level um, competitions we have, but it's going to be the biggest event of our year i think hopefully fingers crossed like loads of support monica and chanel are giving <laughs> us great support being super swannies and how and are you feeling after your world champs last week i'm really sore so <laughs> <laughs> i'm really sore i crashed i got some mega bruises but fingers crossed this is gonna be great and just like a celebration of cycling i get to cycle on my home roads as a, as a pro cyclist for story racing. Are you looking forward to it? Um, I'm really looking forward to it. Yeah, really. It's going to be brill. Especially with these two. You can't see them right now, but they're going to be shouting for me. Uh, she means me. <laughs> and me. Go, Hannah. Trikes, trikes rule. Look up trike racing. Three wheels, like clown cars. Mega to watch. Yeah, yeah. so how are they to go around the corners and stuff? How do you find the handling of a trike? Oh, have you have you ever seen any, like, mad Red Bull go-kart racing? It's a bit like that. Um, <laughs> so bonkers. You, yeah, basically you crash all the time. There's, like, there's only five trike racing, so maybe the percentage of crashes will be less, but fingers mm. crossed. Have you had a look at the circuit here in here in Yorkshire. I have. It's really hilly and really dangerous. Like they had to change it because it was so dangerous for trikes. Oh really? Um my team manager, shout out Dame Sarah Story, she wrote it and she was like, Oh, we need to have a think of that. So every mm. time you plan an international event for power rides, it's always good to invite a trike and a hand cycle to wreck it as well as two wheels. So we're currently in the car with Chanel, top driver. Oh. <laughs> On our way to Weatherby, where the girls are starting their race today, it finishes in Harrogate. Um, we're currently, it's currently one o'clock, so two hours before their race is when they want to get there. It's all kicking off at three o'clock for them, uh, which is all exciting. They're all kitted up, they're in convoy following. So we're just en route to Weatherby to get parked up, get the girls set up for the warm up, and then the action will kick off. front wheel that we put a split in the neutral service. Oh right, um, I'm not sure. I'm going to have a look. Uh -huh. See you soon, bye! Good luck, Hannah. See you in a bit. Oh, good luck. Oh, Hannah, you can have a look. Chanel was just telling me that um, M&S behind us do unreal giant buttons. Massive! <laughs> now walking down to the start of the race for the girls to do their sign-on procedure and get ready and they're all kitted up ready to go yeah. we're I think more excited than them yes um, to be here in the atmosphere and the crowds are huge already it's building already it's so, gonna be mega uh, it's gonna be unreal isn't it so we need to contain our excitement and also stay chilled for the girls <laughs> Hannah Dines! Go, Hannah! Representing Germany. So we're now on our way back from the start to the car again because we're going now 
we're gonna go to Harrogate to the finish, aren't we? To the finish! Yeah, so the riders have set off. They're on their way, they're racing now, currently. Um, so we're gonna jet across to Harrogate to meet them at the finish, where hopefully we'll have all smiles. Now at the finish in Harrogate, where it is absolutely rampant, so the finish is actually there. So we're just waiting for our riders to come in. They're giving it their all. Uh, we reckon our girls are due in in about 10 minutes. nice and hot though isn't it? I'm liking, I'm gonna get tan. <laughs> Was that good for riding or not? Unfortunately I'm gonna say no but I really <laughs> struggled, I really struggled. It made me go into spasm a lot because the road wasn't like dead flat. I'm just picky mm. but um my brain is pretty picky, it made it hell. Mm. I felt the hills were real unfortunately but the, the camber just made me go Ugh. So that was a bit sore, and so when I finished, I was a bit upset. But now I've got some food, and I'm all good. <laughs> but did you have fun to a certain extent? <laughs> I did have fun. Every race is fun. You know, I'm really privileged to be able to race for Story Racing, and I'm so glad that Team Story enabled me to do this, and in front of a home crowd in the beautiful sunshine. It's all I could ever dream of. Well, we're super proud of you, aren't we? I'm very proud of you. Well oh, done, mate. Thanks. <laughs> so, how was your race today? Hilly. Hilly, did you enjoy it? Yeah, it's a good course. Um, yeah, quite technical in places. Um, but yeah, not sun was shining. Sun was shining, but was thinking, <laughs> the crowds were amazing. So many people in Harrogate, right, for the finish? Yeah. Oh yeah, I went to the death, death <laughs> thing. <laughs> but you enjoyed it. That's the main thing. Oh yeah, yeah. And you went up on the podium? Yeah. So I was one C one category. So perfect. Yeah, tough for that. Mega day all round then. Yeah. And we're really super proud of you. Fist pump. Pump. <laughs> good job, girl. So we're now back at the car. The girls have done their race. Everything's completed. We're meeting up with Sarah and Barney and everyone for dinner tonight um, in Harrogate to celebrate the girls finishing their race. They did absolutely amazing. The finish of these races is crazy. There are so many people in Harrogate. It's ridiculous. Um, so filming wise, we were quite run off our feet, but the girls did incredible. We're super proud of them. We just tried to make their life as easy as possible. Um, we're all starving, so ready for some food um, and to get changed. A glorious day, like, and doesn't pick up, but literally blue skies all day, so it's been perfect. Um, yeah, and I'm super proud of them. They were relaxed, they stayed composed, so you girls are inspirational. And now for some food. Hey! <laughs> so, where are we? We're in Harrogate. For the what? You see I wear Rose World Championship, I think. Yeah, so we're here, it's the mix, it, what is it, the mixed team time trial for the World Championships, right? Okay, a bit of a tongue twister, but we're here. GB are off. <laughs> GB, GB have just gone past on lap what? Lap one, they've just lap started. Lap one, okay, so they've just started. We'll come back to you with race footage next time. Ciao. Bye. day two of the of Yorkshire 2019 World Championships really exciting GB finished bronze with Denmark taking the world title and Ger Germany was second weren't they? Silver, yeah. yeah Germany took the silver medal so super exciting a lot of standing up on our feet watching um, I found a chair yeah. the rain actually poured like was pretty heavy for GB when they went off like the earlier riders and then it pretty much stopped for Denmark and Germany. So I think they probably had the better conditions of the day. Whether that changed the result, we don't know. But um, 
Each team gave their absolute all. GB was sat in the hot seat basically all day until those two other teams crossed the line. So shout out to those gals and boys doing such a great job in that and representing the team so well. And now we're on our way home. Well, not home yet. Back to the cottage where I'm leaving. These girls. We're here, Yorkshire. <laughs> These girls are staying um, for another couple of days to get more of the action at the race tomorrow. They're coming back into Harrogate to catch more of the racing. I'm heading home because I'm on a new adventure next week, but I've super enjoyed my time. Back with my story racing teammates, catching all the action from Yorkshire and I'm super jealous that I'm not staying. So I'm now back at home, finally. Just had two hours back from Harrogate. Such a good day today, literally such a good day. Um, the weather was not on our side, so unfortunately I didn't film that much. I'll try and like piece in as much as I can, but um, yeah, it was incredible to see the team time trial, the mixed team time trial, um, which is a new event. Um, I think it's only been trialed at like Euros before, so it was just super exciting. We didn't get to see much from a spectator point of view because obviously they start and then they finish a little bit further down so we watched them start and the girls roll out um once the boys had finished um which was super cool got to catch up with sarah and barney and the kids and everyone so it was super nice to see them before i catch up with them again in a couple of weeks time and um, for another little adventure so super fun day and i'm super grateful to my team who allowed me to be amongst the atmosphere with the para girls and um take it all in it was such a great couple of two days i'm really really tired but super happy and in a good spirits and good mood so 